Kate Middleton, Princess of Wales, has cancer. She released this information in a video recording um, that was released to the world about what she's been going through. She mentions that she had major abdominal surgery, at which time it was thought that her condition was non-cancerous. And after the surgery, it was found out that, in fact, she did have cancer cells, and it was recommended that she undergo preventative chemotherapy. According to a statement by um, uh, uh, the palace, uh, she's been undergoing preventative chemotherapy since February. Um, this, is, um, this is big, huge, important, life-changing news. Cancer is tough for everyone. Um, it is tough for everyone. And uh, Princess Kate is a young woman. Um, she's a young mother, wife, daughter, uh, sister, and so much more, uh, and a and, uh, member of the royal family who is now charged with a cancer diagnosis, which she has talked a little bit about having to navigate, how to, how to talk to her children. Um, cancer affects us emotionally, mentally. It affects us physically. It affects our bodies. It changes our bodies. And then chemotherapy as a treatment regimen uh, also changes our bodies and, and often uh, usually uh, makes our immune system not work as well. You know, her whole life is changed uh, and is changing. Her ability to be out in public uh, from an immune standpoint and, and other things, I'm sure the palace is taking into consideration along with her doctors. The point being is, is this is a, a very, this is a life-changing diagnosis, not only for her, but for the world. Um, and what's important now is that uh, uh, Kate Middleton and her family have the time and the space and the respect and the love and the prayers um, that they need to cope with this and to allow her to heal. Uh, Princess Kate, we are, we are praying for you and we are wishing you, we are wishing you well.